Hi, I'm Hello Rodney. Thanks for clicking on my video. I just got up from a nap. Ugh. Oh, man. But uh, I was reading some of my comments. Some of my comments. Yeah, I got like thousands of comments. <coughs> this guy, Kenneth. 1950. Great to see you in San Lorenzo, Florence. I've been living here for the last 18 years. 44 years old when I first arrived. Just passing through, still here. But what are you going to do? Actually, I think that was about the time that I was that I went there. Let's see if there's a date. I don't think there's a date on this. Oh, I can't remember if there's a date on this uh, thing or not. I did a show in San Lorenzo. Uh, not in San Lorenzo, in Florence. Uh, I don't see a date. There might be a date on this thing somewhere, but I can't remember. I think it was I think it was around that period around that time period. He's been there for 16 years. Was at the uh, ACP Gallery. Well, I can't find the date on this thing. But it's really kind of funny because uh, I want to show you something about that. And I don't know if I told you the story or not about being in Florence. Okay. Okay, let me show you this one thing. Ugh. This is the picture. You know, he sort of confirmed it that I'm in Florence here. But this is the picture. That's, I think, pretty sure that's in Florence. Okay, that church, Church of San Lorenzo. But look how the, look how the, the how, how this thing got framed. There's my picture right there, and then it comes down that thing over there, where it was in front of. But it looks like it looks like I'm looks like it's my actual head with this sort of scarf thing around my neck. So I think that's really great. But uh, the church in San Lorenzo, when I went to, uh, the show was in Salzburg. So I stayed, I stayed uh, in Salzburg for the first, I don't know, maybe three or four days, you know, and then I went to, uh, and then I went to uh, Florence and then I went to Rome. And then the last part of my trip, I went to Paris. Because when I was there, I wanted to see ancient, the ancient, uh, the Renaissance, and modern. So that's, the ancient is Rome, the uh, 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 Renaissance is Florence, and the modern would be, you know, uh, Paris. So that's what I did. And uh, when I went to... Uh, I went to Florence. They've got they've got Michelangelo's uh, Day and Night there, and uh, it's beautiful, you know. And so it was the last day that I was there, and I re just re and I remembered, oh, I gotta go see see that. And I ran over there as quickly as I could, and they were closed. Oh man, I was going, oh man, this is not good. They freaking closed. Oh no. But they had a note on the door. We'll be open tonight. You know, wow, if we open tonight, okay. So I went that night and I met two people there that were uh, from somewhere else. And they had been there for many years in Florence. And uh, they said that they had only seen it open twice at night since they'd been there. And I just happened to see it, thank God, you know. So I got to go there and, and see the Church of San Lorenzo. And that is a beautiful place, one of the most beautiful places, you know, it was just magnificent. So I just wanted to uh, uh, do a video about that. And uh, this guy, he's uh, Kenneth, that's his name, let's see, Kenneth1950. Uh, he's a jeweler, and he, his jewelry is beautiful. Go check him out. Kenneth, 1950, and uh, I'll put a link 
if I can remember, you know, to his video. Uh, but uh, he's a jeweler there in uh, Florence, from what I, I think that's what he does. You see, uh, I live and work in Italy as a teacher and jeweler slash sculptor from New Zealand. Oh, he's from New Zealand. Lived here for 12 years as a, for 12 years. As I do not, at the moment, own a webcam, I will watch others' efforts uh, that make an effort to make some sort of contribution. Well, you make a big contribution to me. I'm from Auckland, New Zealand. I really appreciate that. So, um, go check out this guy. I guess he doesn't make videos, but he's, go check out his, uh, his website. Uh, I'll check it out. Let's see here. Jules of the Arno. His name is uh, KennethScottDesign.com. Customized jewelry classes are able to meet the requirements that a student or group needs. Professional English speaking tutor, fully equipped studio facilities. This right here, this is a that's a bridge that goes over the Arno River in Florence, and this is noted for its jewelry. They used to have, like, that was where the jewelers would, would do their work and sell their, sell their things. So, anyway, that's great. So, probably now that I'm doing this video about the guy, he'll say, Oh, you know what? Wow. Why don't you come and, and, and stay in Florence? You know, I've got a, uh, a friend that has a, a little tiny cubby hole where you can stay for free. <laughs> I love Florence, man. That is a beautiful, beautiful city. You should see that city. When I first got to Florence, I wanted to have a pizza, okay? I wanted to have a pizza. So I was there by uh, El Duomo, which is a church, and uh, uh, it's a beautiful story. You do have to do your own research on that. But El Duomo, uh, the church is huge and it's pink it's really beautiful so on the I think it's the north side I'm not sure give my directions a little wrong now that I'm not there but I think it's the north side of the church uh, well as you go let's see if you're going into the church it would be on the left side and it's it's it's, it's pretty close to the street there's a little street there and so I was sitting I was sitting at this little this little uh, cafe outdoors sitting there and the church with it was was at my let's see it was at my left and I was looking at it you know and they, they, the pieces are like crackers there I'm looking at this thing eating this pizza you know? it's like wow it's right there oh it's magnificent wow you gotta go to that place Florence is just oh man I love it there okay I'm Hello Rodney thanks for watching it bye bye